I feel like I look like I'm going to like a soccer game or something. Is it like this little headband? What is up? I hope you're having an amazing day. So today I'm really excited because we're gonna be doing a chit chat. Get ready with me. We're gonna be chit chatting a lot. I have a lot of cool things to tell you. Just wanna chat. And I have a lot of makeup products to use. Just like actually like a lot. I can't even show them all. Well, I can, but it'll take a while. But yes, let's just I think start getting ready. Tarting, tarting, tart. Uh, no, this is not actually from Tart. This is the Too Faced Hangover RX Primer. This is definitely one of my favorites, I'll have to say. I always see like Carly Bible use this and she says she like swears by it and everything. And honestly, I feel like Carly Bible is like one of my favorite YouTubers. She's so calming in a way. I feel like she just, I don't know, I love it. And I feel like she's so real and she really connects with her subscribers and I love her cats too. They're so cute. And yeah, actually right at the moment I'm fostering a little kitty and he is adorable. He's the sweetest little thing, um, but he's very shy. He just like runs and he just runs when I try to pick him up. But once I pick him up, he is so cuddly, sweet. He purrs, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Do you have any tips on like how to get your cat to be more like loving? I don't know, this is like our foster kitty and we're trying to help him out. But yeah, let me know. I blended in that primer. Now I'm gonna go in with foundation. It's kind of like a BB cream. This is the Milk Makeup Skin Tint. And if you see this on my hand, I was out in the backyard and let's just say I fell. So we have like wood in our backyard and it was super slippery from the rain, but I was just kind of like running around, not running, yeah, I'm running around pretty much. Um, and I slipped and I like fell on the right side of my body and I kind of just roughed up everything. Here, let me just like, yeah, it's bad. And I also have that on my leg too. It's not fun, but, um, that's what happens when you run and it's slippery. <laughs> like, I don't know what I was thinking, but it's okay. And what I love about this foundation, I feel like you can kind of like see this, but like my skin just like, it's not too covered. You know what I mean? It's just like, looks like your skin is like skin tinted. I don't know. That's what probably they call it a skin tint, but I really love milk. I feel like they have such cool products and I feel like I need to try more from them, but Yes, I'm just gonna blend all that in. And oh my gosh, I have a hair in my nose. Oh, oh, I feel like the headband should keep all my hair back, but it never does. Mm, well. Then going in with concealer, this is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Concealer. And honestly, this is really nice. It's quite thick and it's kind of like the Tarte Shape Tip. You can't really feel it, but it covers everything. And honestly, they have such an amazing shade range, I'll have to say. But uh, I got like the medium and I feel like it's a little bit dark, but honestly, I don't really like brightened under eyes because I, I just see all these beauty bloggers use like these super bright concealers. I'm like, whoa, Nelly. I don't know. It just doesn't look good on me. So I just use like the same skin tone, not same skin tone, same like scheme, what? Same like color concealer. So it's like, it matches my whole entire face. It's not too light. But I'm gonna blend this concealer in and honestly, this Wet n Wild concealer lasts really long. It like, you don't even have to set it. I love this combination so much. It's just stuff. What? It's definitely one of my favorites. So now I'm gonna go in with powder, and this is my CoverGirl Advanced Radiant Powder. I actually have hit pan on it, and that means that I really like it because I don't really hit pan on a lot of things, like only like a few things. Oh my gosh, I really love this powder. I can't let it go. Um, but yeah, I can't let it go, let it go. You know, like the <laughs> Frozen. Oh my gosh, I should see Frozen again. I love Frozen. It's like my favorite movie. Olaf is like mm, the best. I love him. But yeah. I've been trying so many new foundation brushes. Like it's nuts because I've been trying to find like my perfect foundation brush and it may be coming up on Brilliance really soon. It's really hard to find a really good foundation brush, but I am looking, I'm adjusting, I am finding so many, um, but yes. And also on Frilliance, you were requesting to bring the makeup cleaner back. And I love that makeup cleaning mat. It is honestly so, I love it. It's just so efficient and just so easy. Cause honestly, I hate like cleaning my brushes like underwater or with oil because I feel like I just, it ruins my brushes. And then it takes too long to dry and then I try to blow dry them, but then they blow dry crooked. I don't know, but I just, I love the brush cleaning and you guys wanted it back, so I thought I'd just bring it back. So it is back on my Amazon account. I'll have it linked below. Um, but yeah, if you're like, you know, what's Brilliance? Um, it's actually a makeup tool line that I have come out with. I'm just so excited about it. I've been working on it. Quick pause, this is the Rimmel Natural Bronzer that I'm using, um, but I'm just so excited about Brilliance. I think it's just, I'm just, I love it so much. I'm so excited of what's to come. And ooh, makeup brushes are hard, but I'm so excited about finding really good ones. And I'm gonna be taking the Revolution um, makeup. Wait, I, I use this so much, like the packaging's wearing off, but Revolution has such great products. This is the Hot Spice Blush Palette, and I need to try more from them because they're super affordable. This palette was $10, it comes with eight shades, which like each blush is like 
just like so cheap like i'm just like whoa it's really good quality too and it lasts all day so i'm just gonna take like this like peachy warm shades people want that to make sense um but these like warm shades and just kind of mix them together and oh, i love this blush palette so much and i feel like it just like works but it's not too pigmented to be like oh you know and then you have to like go in with your foundation brush and like blot it off um but yes really loving this blush palette and brilliance and just all that then I think you guys are gonna be really proud of me. A lot of people are like, oh my gosh, Fiona, you use this like Tartsy palette forever to store your like um, highlights from the Anastasia Glow Kit. Because I only use two colors from the Anastasia Glow Kit, but honestly, I would repurchase it a billion times because it's my favorite formula. Um, but I bought a little mini Z palette for my favorite shade. It never exaggerates my texture. It's just so creamy. It's glowy. It's my perfect shade. And the Anastasia Glow Kit is definitely my favorite highlighters ever. I just love them. Then a lot of you guys have been asking me for an acting update. Like, are you, like, stopping acting? Like, what's going on? I feel like I haven't seen, like, very many acting vlogs. Your acting vlogs are my favorite. You know, like, you have been asking a lot about acting. And... <laughs> Give me a second before I answer that. Oh gosh. <laughs> Luckily, I didn't drop it. Drop it. What? I obviously dropped the stuff. Um, but, like, nothing broke. Luckily. And also, I'm going in with my single shadow. This is from Colourpop and this is the shade Save It For Later. It's one of my favorite like golden brown shades. And I'm just gonna take my finger and smudge that kind of like all over my eye. Um, but for an acting update, I still am gonna be doing acting, but it's just gonna be definitely shifted. It's gonna definitely not be as much because I love YouTube so much and I love acting just so much too. Like I love them both so much. And I'm also working on some, <laughs> some cool things that are coming. And I also have school and I just have like, a lot of things I'm juggling and it's just super hard just to get everything done you know like because like I want to put like my best foot forward on all these things I don't want to just like you know like eh it you know like I just I, I want to do everything the best I possibly can and acting is just very it's very time consuming I'll have to say you had to have a lot of you know time and you had to put a lot of you know money into it I don't usually talk about like money on my channel but like it is it's it's really hard to do it you know like we have to pack up everything we have to figure out who's gonna stay at our house because we have all of our pets then the acting schedule has to like align with my parents schedule and then we all have to drive down there we had to book a hotel which is you know expensive and it takes so much time and it's, so I'm not doing as much acting as I used to but I am no way letting it go I'm still gonna do stuff like I'm still gonna go up to San Francisco still gonna go up to LA but just not as much yeah it's just it's it's definitely difficult I'll have to say um then I'm gonna go in with the nude sticks blossom lipstick and then I'll go with mascara if you're like Fiona you missed mascara don't worry um but I'm gonna go with lipstick first but it's just so hard to do all of them so I'm not doing as much acting but I'm okay with that because I can pick it up later you know maybe we'll all go down to LA for a month and we'll you know stay in like a cool apartment and I'll be able to film my YouTube videos do my special projects do my school and acting you know it's just hard because we don't live in LA you know what I mean and it's still like it's six hours to drive down there and just the process of acting is kind of hard and just balancing all this stuff is definitely difficult so I'm not doing as much acting but I am no way stopping it so yes that's my acting update for now but I'll of course keep you always posted because you are so amazing you are a part of my life I cannot believe you're watching this right now thank you and yes that is my acting update then I'm gonna dab some of this pop lip gloss on top of that because my lips are just no matter what dry and I like glossy lips in general I don't know why but I just do so I'm gonna take this pop lip gloss and it's in the shade bare nectar I just mmm and yeah so now I'm gonna go in with some mascara I have I'm like good talking with gaps but this is my favorite one this is the ow I just like pinched my eyelashes well obviously it's kind of what you're doing with an eyelash product, but I looked at oh wow my eyes watering now um but this is the L'Oreal voluminous mascara and I'm just going to pop that on this is what the look looks like I think it's just like really natural bronze but with like a little bit of eyeshadow um it's kind of like my everyday look uh, which I just love I feel like I do a lot of them but honestly I feel like I just I feel like glowy fresh skin is just so beautiful looking and bye. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day.